Okay, so here's the next stage. All these chains are wired in, or not wired in. Um, tensioners are on them. They're down to the hydraulic motors. I figured out my combined reduction from the motor to the wheel is 106 to 1. That should give us just over 3,000 foot pounds of torque at each side. So just over 6,000 combined. All the motors are almost wired in, just have a couple of control wires to, or each motor has a position sensor in it. So the main power wires are wired, but the position sensors aren't yet. The joystick was kind of difficult. Couldn't find one. So I know it looks kind of redneck, but the way it works is you need both motors to go forward, obviously. Both need to go in reverse. But when you go sideways, one motor needs to reverse and one needs to go forward. So I don't know if you can see it, but you pull forward, it'll pull both to the throttles forward. These springs are actually switches, so the stock is um, has one wire on it, and then each spring has another wire on it, and it's insulated from the case. So when you go in reverse, it touches both springs. I checked it with a multimeter, and it does work, and that'll reverse both motors full speed. When you go right, it will actually give the um, left motor or when you go right it'll go give the left motor full speed forward but the right motor full speed reverse so time will tell if that uh, works well but we couldn't find a joystick so that was about the best alternative the motors might get hot if you're working them hard so this is actually a boat um, sump fan and it's four inch and it will go basically in that hole and the elbow is basically to keep oil from getting up in the fan and then there's a little this is basically a little thermostat and it's adjustable and it has a little 12 volt relay built in and then a little temp probe so the temp probe will go inside the case and then obviously the screen can go outside so you can adjust what temperature you want the fans to turn on at and basically in the winter they might not need to run at all 